Please welcome the lovely Kristen Bell, everybody. <laughs> I love your hair off to one side. Thank you very no, much. No, it's really nice. It's kind of like coming through everybody. It is, it is. I've got some on this side. Yeah, no, I wasn't saying you only had hair on one side. It's been cut, though, and... No, it hasn't. It's just really? been pinned. Tricks Ooh, of the trade. Nice. <laughs> that looks good. This film looks very frightening. It is pretty frightening. I've seen it now twice. Did you get stabbed? Maybe. It's none of your beeswax. <laughs> you mean none of my beeswax? You're here to promote the film. I you got to tell me. I can't tell you that. Well, you do, clearly. Maybe not. <laughs> hey, Jeff. Oh, hey. <laughs> Are you guys still at this? This is ridiculous. Jeff, this doesn't concern you, Craig. <laughs> Did you have fun in Vegas? Yeah, yeah, I had a um, great time. They, they say that anyone can get laid in Vegas. Did you finally disprove that theory? Concern Don't you, be hating on the robot. He's an appliance. You come here, you're always angry at the robot. It's ridiculous. Did, did anyone confuse him with a slot machine and stick a quarter up his butt? Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yes, they did. <laughs> Did you win any money? No, I don't gamble at all. Really? No, I don't do it. I'm not interested in it at all. I like it. We're gambling? Yeah, well, I just, I like the slot machine and I like roulette. Roulette? Yeah. That's fool's poker. Yeah, but there was one time where I shot a movie in um, Laughlin, like Lake Havasu, Arizona, and I, I had seen some special on television where there was like a secret to roulette, and I'd memorized all the rules, and I definitely went into the Laughlin Casino, which is... Oh, I know. It's not a very young casino. No. <laughs> um, hey, and I look at this little <laughs> hobby over here. And I played roulette for like seven hours, and I did win a couple hundred dollars, but I, I had, to, you had to stick with that. And I, I was just swept up in it. I thought I knew the rules. No. Hey, did you ever it's see that? Game. Did you ever see that CBS show, Viva Laughlin? Do you remember that show? <laughs> It was this show where it was set in Lachlan, Nevada, and um, was in it? They were, and and they were like it was a musical. So people would like they would be talking and act like who was in it? Melanie Griffith or somebody or Meg Ryan or yeah, you know uh, somebody like that. And when, when was it on? Oh, like uh, a couple of years ago. I, we only lasted a few episodes. It was that good. <laughs> I mean, it was fantastic. They were like, hey. Living Woo! la vida loca. It's fantastic. All the good ones get canceled. Yeah, I know. Mm. You know. Oh, you were in a show that got canceled. It was a great show. That Veronica Mars show. That was. was awesome. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Are you Thanks. going to make a movie of that? I hope so one day, but <sighs> Warner Brothers does may, maybe does not hope so. Really? Why? Yeah, Why I don't know. They just don't think there's an audience for it. So I'm just constantly trying to convince them that there is. All right. Well, Warner Brothers one probably day. the best. They're a benign, lovely they... organization. Yeah. <laughs> but I did a pilot this year that just got picked up. Really? What's yeah. it called? It's called House of Lies. House of Lies? Yeah. Awesome. Is it like House of Pies in Los Feliz, but in fact it's House of Lies? It's lies instead of pies? Exactly. Have you ever been to House of Pies? Absolutely. Like, House of, of Pies course. is fantastic, it's, isn't it? It's like time traveling. Like yeah. you're absolutely time traveling like a hundred years ago when you go in there. When the, pies were delicious. Bingo. Yeah. <laughs> Bingo. It's a good little joint, that place. It is. And so is your show about uh, people that run a pie shop mm -mm. and lie about it? You'd think. Um, but no, it's about uh, sort of high-powered consulting firms. Oh, okay, that sounds great. It's not, it's not, it's, it won't go over your head. It's like big, dirty business, you know, like consulting. Big, dirty business? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Remind you of anyone? <laughs> uh -huh. No. <laughs> <laughs> I think big dirty business is funny. <laughs> so do you. I do. Yeah. So uh, there's no pies in it at all then? There's no pies in it. But well, Don Cheadle's luck with in that. it. Don Cheadle's good, but he's no, he? he's no pie though. Well, I actor. mean, when I first heard he was in it, I said, I normally make a rule not to work with Do Oscar that. winners. Yeah. <laughs> because, you know. But then yeah. I said, I'll give him a chance. And I think he's got a future in this business. Yeah, he'll he's be pretty all right. good. He's You'll pretty good. Right. I'm not, I'll just take my word for it. Although he was in, we've all uh, we've all made mistakes in our life. He was in Hotel for Dogs. No, he 
he wasn't. Yes, he was. Are you thinking of Hotel I, Rwanda? No, I'm not thinking of Hotel Rwanda. He was also in Hotel Rwanda, but he was also in Hotel for Dog. He's cornered the market on hotel movies? Very different movies. <laughs> <laughs> Hotel Rwanda was nowhere near, uh, I mean, the other way around, anyway. <laughs> Hotel for Dogs is, uh, is a, did you, you never saw no, it? No, but I wanted to see it so bad. I really did, and I kept telling Dax, can we please go see that? And he would be like. Yeah, I, uh, <laughs> I'm kind of with Dax on this. I actually, so I saw it because, uh, because I have a, a young boy, mm -hmm. and, you know, and he said, oh, hey, there's a movie about, and it's a Hotel for Dogs. We thought this would be hilarious. No, not so much. Uh, but don't you think any anytime you see dogs doing cute stuff, it's always funny, right? Yeah, yeah, you'd think, right? But it was just so it was just Don that was bad. Yeah, no, no, no. Don Cheadle was great. I'm he, just, okay. he was great. He brought real meaningful presence. I'll bet he did. To an I'll otherwise bet he did. convincing story about a hotel for dogs. <laughs> Of which there are like 15 in Los Angeles. FYI. No, no. Well, I suppose there are. Yeah, but this was a different one. This was a. Oh, look. It's, I, I can't even believe I'm explaining this crap movie to you. I, I don't mean any disrespect to the people who worked in the movie who are or from the Reno. Dogs. <laughs> You're slamming Reno. I'm tonight. not slamming Reno. It was just a joke. I don't okay. mean it. I've never right, been hey, to Reno. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Hey, don't. Are you from Reno? No. Have you ever been? No. <laughs> I, I have been. You have? Yeah. Are you going to go back? Nope. <laughs> no, I'm not. Hey, we got to take a break. Whatever. This actress, I can't remember her name. Uh, it was a joke. It was a joke. Of course, I, I remember I your name. <laughs> so, let, right, so big business, uh, risky business. What's the name of the show? Risky House of Lies. House of Lies, yeah. <laughs> big, big, uh, it's a big. It's about consulting firms. Uh, the, you know, they go into these pie stores and and, and then you and they shout, eat as many pies move as possible. The bus! And they move the bus and. It's gonna be. Yeah, that'll be fantastic. Do you watch that show, The Makeover Show? What's it called? Extreme Home Makeover? Yeah, that Absolutely. One. That's a good show, that. Ooh, get yeah. a box of tissues. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Woo! Do I cry that? Do you watch all the reality shows? I watch a lot of them, yeah. Yeah, I know. <laughs> watch, do you watch the Beverly Hills Housewives? I only watched Atlanta, oh, and I was like, I was just paralyzed. No, no. I haven't seen the Atlanta one. I watched the Beverly Hills it's one. It's intense. Oh, my Lord. Yeah. It's, it, they make you feel so good about yourself, because no matter how much of a screw up you are, you're like, wow, well, I'm They're not very that, positive yeah. shows. They're very positive yeah, shows. Yeah, no, I think that's what they're for. I think that's what they, you know, you can watch them and go, oh, I'm not that bad. Right. Yeah. You can make excuses for everything else in your life. Yes, yes, you can. Well, not everything. Not everything? Do you, do you, did you ever watch Jersey Shore? I, I watched it once because everyone had talked about it, and I thought, these kids aren't that bad. I don't understand. They're just like drunk kids being stupid. Yeah, yeah. with I mean, video if cameras. If there cameras around when I was that age, I'd still be in jail. Right, and if you would have taped it, it probably would have been a great TV show. Mm. <laughs> great for who? Uh, yeah, I suppose it would have been interesting spectator sport, but there's a lot of embarrassing stuff in my past. I'm not like you, young, Boring. fresh, full of life and promise i'm a corrupt old i'm not that young oh yeah you are how old do you think i am about 43. <laughs> <laughs> you're like you're like 20. i'm 20. 20 i'd say about 24. Right. Tw about 24. you're right 21. hi i'm kristen We've met before. I'm 30. I turned 30 last year. No way. Look at you. You wear your big boy pants now? Yep. <laughs> yes, I do. Yeah. Got my license and everything. Yeah. Hey, uh, do you have a pilot's license? No. Oh. I do. <sighs> I know. I've heard. But I did fly in a Cessna last month, uh, a tiny little Cessna over Kenya, and it, they had painted the exterior like a giraffe. <gasps> That's dangerous. 
To look like a giraffe? Yes, in Kenya there are actual giraffes. What if a real giraffe is going, oh, look, a giraffe, and then... And then going, you, hey, baby. Yeah, yeah, and then you flew it. No, giraffes get up there. They're very tall, so if you're a tall giraffe, you're coming along, it goes, oh, another giraffe. It goes in for a kiss. Carnage. <laughs> Did you know that giraffes sleep standing up with their eyes open? So if you ever see a giraffe in the wild, or in the zoo for that matter, and they're just sort of standing up like this, they're probably asleep. Yeah, or, or they could be awake, because they do very little else but stand there like that. That's true. That's true. I mean, it's not like a giraffe's going, what's that giraffe doing? Oh, look, he's typing. <laughs> I mean, that's what they do. They're either like that, or they're like that. Sometimes they're like this. <laughs> The big thing for giraffes is when they go drinking. Oh, look, it's drinking. And everybody gathers around, the giraffe leans over. <laughs> it's like one of those things that used to be in your grandma's house. Do you know what I mean? Those little things that are filled with ink? Yeah. What are they called My again? My grandma didn't have them. Those are like Squid. on your business manager's desk, and they just sit there. Oh, well, Like, you well, see that in movies when people are getting fired, and they just zoom in on that little thing. <laughs> Time is ticking away till you're canned. <laughs> painted a scenario there. I'm a storyteller, Craig. Yes, you are. You should go on that VH1 show. Which one? Storytellers? storytellers yeah. <laughs> All right, when the or pilot's Unplugged. Done. I want to see Jeff on Unplugged. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh, All right. <laughs> All right, well, uh, we're done here again. It All goes right. so quickly when you're here. It really does. Yeah, it really does. I'm terribly sorry. You got to get a new um, tooth. Yeah, I'm taking him to a fake snake dentist later. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting it capped. You should get a gold tooth. You should give me a gold tooth with your money from House of Pies. Okay. I'll get you a gold tooth. Get me a gold tooth from a snake, and then I'll okay. know that our love is real. Okay. All right. Fair enough. And so will Jeff. And so will Jeff. Yeah. Hey, Kristen, look. I'm ticking away till your segment's over. <laughs> tick, tick, tick. <laughs> tick, tick, tick. All right, that's enough. Don't be rude. Don't be rude. I'm, I'm terribly... That's a good joke, Jeff. Yeah, I know. That's, he's very rude. I don't know what's happened to him. Really. <laughs> So, uh, mouth organ, awkward pause, what do you fancy? I, I will do an awkward pause. I've never done an awkward pause before. Oh, okay. There are, there are no rules, but no talking, obviously, because it's a pause. Well, it's a pause. We could do the regular awkward pause. We could do awkward pause with uh, sexual undertones, or we could do the most awkward of awkward awkward pauses, smell my finger awkward pause. <laughs> smell my finger awkward pause? Of course. Okay. Thank you.